as of Monday the 15th of June, face coverings will become mandatory on public transport. That doesn't mean surgical masks, which we must keep for clinical settings. It means the kind of face covering you can easily make at home. There'll be exemptions to these rules for very young children, for disabled people, and those with breathing difficulties. But broadly, as we come through this phase, we're doing what many other countries have asked transport users to do. And as passenger numbers increase, and we expect this trend to continue, we need to ensure every precaution is taken on buses, trains, aircraft, and on ferries. With more people using transport, the evidence suggests that wearing face coverings offers some, albeit limited, protection against the spread of the virus. A face covering helps protect our fellow passengers. It's something that we can each do to help each other. And this will mean that you can be refused travel if you don't comply and you could be fined. Alongside transport operators, this will be enforced by the British Transport Police if necessary, but I expect the vast majority of people won't need to be forced into this because wearing a face covering helps protect others and most people simply want to help defeat this disease.